YouTube, what is going on? It's your boy Bungie back in today with another video. People are joining me. What is going on? I'm trying to make a YouTube video person. Get out of here. <sighs> Anyways, today I'm bringing you a special video. We're going to be doing a PvP hunter loadout. Um, I know a lot of people when I stream, people want to know what I'm using. Uh, especially what sniper I'm using and all of that good stuff. So I'm bringing you that fucking video right now. Uh, so let's hop into it. Um, I'm going to hit the start button, okay? And we're going to go right there, okay? And there she is. Well, it's a he, but... Okay, I'll, 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 I'll make him go in a circle here so you can see the beautiness of what I, I possess here with my hunter. I call him Barry. His name's Barry. Anyways, let's start with the gun side, guys. Well, first off, we'll start with Blade Dancer. Um... This is all I use. I, all I use is Blade Dancer. I'll use Gunslinger on my on my second character, um, but I like to use Blade Dancer just for the simple fact of blink and I can go invisible. Yes, I go invisible. If you call me a douchebag, I don't really care because it works and I win that way. So fuck you guys. Um, as you can see, the what I really run is I don't really run a lot of recovery. Um, I run a lot of armor and agility. Uh, I like agility because I can get to sniper spots a lot quicker than most people, and that's how I can hit my shots better. Uh, other than that, yep, like I said, I run the invincibility. Invisibility? Fuck! I always say invincibility. I am invincible, but not really. Anyways, moving on. Obviously, I have the thorn. I mean, look at these other guns I, I have. Nothing else is, is up to what the thorn is. Uh, I'll show you the perks on it, but I mean, it's pretty much going to be what other people use. You know, uh, increased range. Um, I got the final round on it, obviously, and I have the th the mark of the devourer, obviously. I mean, you have to have that on there. Let's just look at the beautiness of this gun. Ugh. Very good, very good. Okay, now we're moving on. Here is what people would like to know. I'll start off with other guns first. Um, I have the Icebreaker, the Vestin Dynasty, the Fourth Horseman, the Swordbreaker, the Subtil Nudge, which is a real piece of shit weapon. Highly do not recommend that. Very highly do not recommend that. Uh, and the Felwinner's Lie and the Matador. This motherfucker is talking in my video. Get out of here. Oh my god, people. I gotta literally make my thing invite only. Like, damn, man. I'm trying to make a damn YouTube video. Anyways, back to the YouTube. Alright, this is my baby, guys. This is my baby. This is the Eye of Soul. Obviously, Solar 365. Um, I got this in the Prison of Elders, I believe. Um, as you can see, the impact is pretty low, but uh, what I truly, truly like about this gun that not a people like know about is look at this fire rate. I can shoot this as fast as a uh, NL Shadow. Like I, if I miss a shot, I'm fine with that because I can always, if I hit a body shot um, and he doesn't die, I can always come back and pop him again in the body. Um, so it's pretty it's pretty easy if I do miss a headshot to come back and get the kill um, Range is awesome stability is really really good, and I can reload this extremely fast uh, The perks I have on this is the short gaze SL H10 I love this scope because it zooms in very quick good range um, It's nothing too long and, and actually the sight on it when you zoom in shows a lot of the range, like a lot of the area around it so it gives you a pretty good view of what you're trying to snipe. Um, I have Army of One, unassisted kills with this weapon, reduce grenade and melee cooldown. That really doesn't do shit. I'll be straight up honest with you. Uh, this is the, I can't re-roll this, so this is what I got with it. So unfortunately, it kind of sucks. Um, I have Quick Draw, Snapshot, and Send It. A lot of people say to put Send It on there, but I don't need it. I have already good enough accuracy and range with it. Um, I would rather have Snapshot to where I can aim this weapon incredibly fast. Uh, quick draws, okay. I'd rather have that on, like, you know, a hand cannon or something else. Uh, I don't really need it on a sniper. And I have unflinching, easier to aim when under fire. This is pretty good. Um, I don't see much of a difference with this, to be honest with you. But, I mean, it's still, you know, a decent perk to have. I'll show you guys the other scopes as well. It's the long view. And this is the eagle eye. Uh, the eagle eye just fucking looks, I don't know, stupid. I don't know why people would have that, but... Yep, that is the eye of soul. That's my baby until I get the herb benevolence. Uh, right now I'm rocking the fear rocket launcher. Um, wow, I really should have grenades and horseshoes on. Holy shit. Uh, and I probably should have sent it too. Holy shit. 
But yep, this is the uh, this is the rocket launcher I use. I rarely ever use rocket launchers. You really never see me use them. But um, when I do, I use this because it's got two in the mag. I like that. Uh, moving on, um, as you can see, you know, hey, look at my dude again. Uh, the reason why I'm wearing this shader, this is actually the new Monarch shader. Um, yeah, I really like this shader. Uh, I've been wanting this shader for a long time until I get Dead Orbit. But right now I'm using the Fear Eater mask. Uh, I just think this looks badass. That's why I kind of use it. I mean, look at that, dude. I look like I should be in Halo right now. Uh, another reason why I use it is increased melee attack speed. I fucking love that. Um, it also has discipline and intellect, so I kind of like that. Um, discipline, I want a ton of discipline because I love chucking nades. Um, and it's got ashes to asset. Replenish super energy when you kill an enemy with a grenade. That is a fucking awesome perk, people. That is a awesome perk. Replenish your super energy when you kill an enemy with a grenade. What the fuck? Hell yeah, right? God damn. All right, and these are all my other. I got you know the Arachnid, Sanction Six. I wear the Sanction Six a lot too. Just got the Celestial Eye out, trying to uh, upgrade that. And I just got this new cover of the Exile because it uh, it had some better perks than my old one, so I picked it up. Uh, moving on, we have the Grips of Exile. This is actually the, look at look at the perks on these. Like just stare at these bitches. Increased reload speed with hand cannon. Fuck yes. Increase melee attack speed. Fuck yes. Increase reload speed with the special weapons. Fuck yes too. These are honestly the best groups you can probably get right now. Uh, and it's got discipline and strength. Like, uh, that's awesome. Uh, as you can see, I don't run a lot of intellect because I do have this ashes to asset perk um, to where if I do get a grenade kill, boom, super energy up. Boom. Um, 85 and 85. Like, that's perfect right there, guys. Anyways. Yo, know, these groups of exile are amazing. Uh, I don't know really. I don't really like how they look with these huge plates sticking out of the side shoulder. Uh, but you can't beat these perks. The only other one that I'd say can come close to it would be these deadlight grips that have essentially the same thing as for speed load. I mean, special weapons reload. Um, these look okay, but I hate that fucking blue line right there. That's really annoying. Uh, but I'll show you my other ones. I got the Prime Z-Lock gloves. The Electors Grips, these are pretty cool. These go good with uh, with what I'm rocking, I think. Um, I got the uh, Don't Touch Me's, those are awesome. I got the Iron Banner Gauntlets, the Watcher's Grips again, which are, these are really cool as well. Uh, and I think they go really well with the, the whole giddy up I got going on here. Uh, and the perks are pretty awesome too, you know. Scout, well actually no they're not, just kidding. <laughs> uh, and then I got the Sanks and Stitches. These are pretty cool, increased uh, grenade throw distance. That's pretty awesome, and increase uh, reload speed of hand cannon. I think these look pretty cool, too. Uh, when they're on them, I'll give you a full view of what they look like. Uh, not too bad, not too bad. Uh, I don't like the black shit. Uh, if it was just all red, it'd look pretty cool. But uh, put those back on. Yeah, it's, I like these grips. I just don't like how they look. Um, so for trials, what you'll see me run a ton, actually every single time, is the Crest of Alpalupe. I'm actually top 2% in the world in Resurrections. I have over 700, and I've had this game for 7 weeks, and Trials has only been out for, uh, I believe, uh, I've actually had this game for 9 weeks, and Trials has only been out for 6 weeks. So in 6 weeks, I mean, that's when I started resurrecting people, I've had 700 in 6 weeks. Do the math. Uh, but you can't beat this chest plate with the strength on it, uh, revive steam is faster, spawn with more orbs, uh, carry more special weapon, and carry more hand cannon. That's pretty awesome, especially when I like to snipe. Uh, but here are my other ones. I got the Iron Banner one. I got the Lucky Raspberry, which is still a really awesome one. Um, I like that you spawn with a grenade. Uh, I got the Relentless Harness. That one's not too good. It looks pretty cool, I won't lie. Um, but it just doesn't do much. Uh, I got the Watcher's Vest, which is pretty good. Sniper rifle and hand cannon ammo. Um, this is probably my favorite one. This is Prime Z-Lot, and I can't say that other fucking word. Uh, but you gotta look at this, dude. Look at this. Doesn't that, doesn't that red shit right here look like a Nike swoosh? Like, doesn't that look sick? These look sick with, like, um, with these bitches. Like, look at that. I feel like I should be running in a, I should, I feel like I should be in the fucking Olympics with what I'm wearing right now. Put me in, coach. Like, goddamn. That red 
fucking swoosh shit is so cool. It's oh, I just wish it had better perks. Except, I mean, it has more carries, but more special ammo. That's cool. But I mean, I wish it had better shit. Uh, I have the vest of exile, which is shotgun and hand cannon, pretty good. And I have the elector's heart. Uh, again, new monarch shit. I have all new monarch stuff, uh, just because I like them the best. Uh, but again, sniper rifle and pulse rifles. I really don't have pulse rifles, so that's not a big deal. Moving on to my boots. I have the boots of exile. I usually rock these. Uh, for a couple of reasons. A, it looks really cool with the shader. Um, and you carry more scout rifle ammo and special weapons ammo. That's actually really not why I use these. I use them because of the discipline. Look at the fucking discipline on this bitch. 147. Dear God, I can't even count that high. That's insane, people. That is insane amount. And that's why I use it. That's why you'll always see me chuck grenades, guys. But anyways. Moving on. I, these are my second ones. The tireless striders. These are sick, guys. Look, look at that dude. Wouldn't, wouldn't you, if you were a chick, you'd bang this dude. I know you would. Don't lie. He looks sick right there with these boots. Unfortunately, the boots don't do much for me. I mean, they carry more heavy weapons, so I will use these in PvE, but not PvP. Uh, and sword bearing. I don't really sword bear because I kind of fucking suck. But uh, moving on. We have the Elector's boots. Obviously, I told you I have new Monarch shit. I just got these Kel Hunters pass. Uh, yeah, they don't do shit, really. Moving on. Carnivore Match. I got these because it looked cool at first. Uh, to be honest with you, these don't look that cool anymore. So, um, fuck. And they don't do shit for you. Like, look at this. Auto rifles. What the fuck? I got the Iron Banner Boot. Scout Rifle. I just like these because I, I think they're a little bit of a, a, a cool change. Uh, and I like the, the, the trees sticking out of the knee, pe knee part. Um, but I will only rock these in Crucible just to look good. Um, I actually, these just got dropped for me in Trials the other day. Um, and this is sick. Discipline at 72 and Strength at 69. And it carries more hand cannon ammo. Holy shit, right? These are really cool. Um, I gotta level them up, but these look pretty sick. Uh, and I probably will be rocking these in the future. Um, and I just got these. This is, uh, these boots. The Strength is 149. It carries more auto rifle and carry more heavy. Uh, I mean, eh, these will probably, you know, eh, they're gone. Um, so I don't really need those. But yeah, he looks pretty sick. I rock this cape because it's a new Monarch cape, and I, and I like that design on the back, and it goes with my shader. Um, but I do have the Legend of Six Coyotes, the Dead Orbit cape, the Shattered Vault Cloak cape, the Cloak of Exile, the Iron Banner cape, the Cloud Walker one from um, the Speaker. I have another new Monarch cape, which is pretty cool. I, I do like this one. Um, I'll rock that some days. And I, uh, I've gotten a shit ton of these Kel Hunters hood. Um, this one's pretty cool. I like how it looks thick and stuff. Um, and I will be rocking this because uh, I like the neck area of it, how it's kind of like a scarf thing. Uh, that's just me. I don't like how it's blue on the back, though. Oh, well, though, you can't have it, you can't have it, uh, you know, both ways, right? All right, moving on to the cool shits. I got, you know, your regular generalist shell ghost. Born from the traveler, picked from the machinery of the light and the ghost as your companion and the faithful guide. A.K.A. the Dinklebot. Uh, I got the XVO uh, Time Breaker. I got two of these bitches. They literally are the exact same. I wish I had the Tumblr. Um, I have the Hilden Seeker. This is what you get for defeating Skolas people. It's a really cool ship. Um, the other other the other ship that I would rock would be the Drought of Nectar, uh, which I have on my other character. But I like this just because it's yellow. It looks pretty sick. Um, my other ships, I mean, self-explanatory. You've probably seen all of these. No big deal. Uh, this is the new Monarch Shader. I got this from a package the other day. It's pretty fucking sick. Uh, my other shader would probably be this this guy right here. Shabami. Uh, the yellow. I love to rock this yellow shader. Again, look at my chest plate. It looks fucking sick. Uh, another one would be Gloho. Gloho is pretty cool. Um, and I will rock this some days, especially, look at those gauntlets, dude. Those gauntlets sick with Gloho. Uh, but I have that. I have Lunar Elegy, whatever the fuck that word is. I, I rock a lot of times the all-white shader. Chatter White is pretty sick. Um, and these are just some Queen's Bounty shaders. They're all right. I mean, they're not too bad looking. I really actually kind of enjoy that shader. Um, some days... Some days I'm like, you know, I'm kind of a pussy, so I don't want to rock pink. But here's some Iron Banner shaders. You know, you got to rock these bitches. And the all-ever-awesome No Shader. 
Fuck yeah. That looks so shitty. This one I just got. This is actually pretty cool. I don't mind this shader. This is a rare shader, but it's the lunar one. Look at, I mean, if I had an orange cape, I would rock this, dude. That looks pretty sick. Um, and we have our emblems, guys. Uh, I'm rocking the legendary moon of Osiris just because it's all yellow. I think that's pretty sick. But I do have the exotic one, the eye of Osiris. Um, and I have the rare one, and I have the other legendary, the Empire Seagull. Uh, I will rock the new Monarch and the Iron Banner when the Iron Banner comes out. I got a Queen's one, you know, stupid shit like that. But yeah, guys, that is my PvP loadout. Um, I'll change it back to the regular shit that I used to have on there. Um, that is what you'll see me be rocking literally all of the time, guys. So if you have any questions, please leave it in the comments below. Uh, like this video if you like the video. I know it was kind of long. Sorry guys I talked for a long time, but I wanted to get everything out there about my character um, If you have any questions, like I said, leave it in the comments follow me on Twitter shoot me shoot me a you know an email uh, Send me a letter if you want. Uh, I don't have a PO box So I'll have to give you my address so don't fucking stalk me or nuke me uh, Other than that I will be bringing you more videos daily and I love you guys. You're fucking awesome And I will see you in the next one people peace